Humans come in such a wide range of shapes and sizes that it can be mind-blowing at times. From a real-life cat woman to a woman whose only goal in life is to weigh a thousand pounds, here are some of the most unusual wives in the world whose stories may shock, astound, and may even inspire you. Be sure to stick around until the end of the video and check out our number one pick because those people definitely took the word weird to a whole new level. Before we move on, I've got a little challenge for y'all that'll take five seconds to complete. So here's the deal. You just leave a like on this video, smash that subscribe button, and hit the notification bell, and you'll get 10 years of amazing luck. <laughs> Try it. It really works. Jocelyn Wildenstein Jocelyn Wildenstein is a New York socialite, known for her lavish lifestyle and extensive cosmetic surgeries. Wildenstein has reportedly spent over $4 million on various procedures. Yep, you heard me, $4 million. Jocelyn's cheek implants, facelifts, and other significant changes made her look more like a feline than a female and have garnered her nicknames such as the Bride of Wildenstein and Catwoman. Her obsession to please her husband and to be pretty in her eyes made the socialite ask the plastic surgeon to make her look like one of her husband's beloved big cats. Um, okay. Needless to say, she ended up one of the worst and most famous cases of plastic surgery addiction. Most tattooed senior wife. So I don't, I don't think that the age I started at was that unusual. When couples get tattooed, they usually get each other's names or their anniversary dates or even a cute little heart. That's most couples. But this one doesn't want to fit in with the rest and have done so in the coolest ways possible. Meet Charlotte Gutenberg and Chuck Helmke. They're not only a happy couple, but they're known as one of the world's most tattooed couples. They also each have the title of most tattooed senior citizens, with Charles coming in first in the male category and Charlotte coming in first in the female one. Together they create a couple with a whole heap of tattoos. In fact, the happy couple currently has 97.5% of their bodies covered in intricate tattoos, and they've spent nearly 2,000 hours in tattoo chairs. That's a really, what a really great way to use your retirement fund. <laughs> the couple even met at the tattoo parlor, which sounds like the two are meant to be. Aww. Allegra Cole. I am satisfied every day with how I look. This is 50-year-old Allegra Cole, and she's got huge breasts. I mean huge, as they measure a whopping 54 inches and weigh over 20 pounds. Wow, that's big. And heavy? She's made a whole career out of that, and now she wants to help other women achieve their aesthetic goals. Her goal is to establish herself as an iconic representation of a sensual woman, good mom, homemaker, and businesswoman. Allegra has become an internet sensation. She is very popular on Instagram, where she has over a million followers. Elisani de Cruz Silva. Although they might look like an odd couple at first, Elisani de Cruz Silva and her boyfriend, Francinaldo Carolo, seem to be a perfect match. Elisani is 6 feet 8 inches tall, while Francinaldo is a mere 5 foot 4 inches. While most people think of fashion models as being quite tall, Elisani's height has been a hindrance rather than an asset in that regard. Although she still dreams about strutting the catwalk, she's had many agencies turn her down due to her size. A tumor on her pituitary gland was to blame for her above average height, and since it's been removed, she stopped growing and even shrank about an inch. That's the good thing when it comes to her love life, considering she already has to stoop down to kiss her partner. Despite being rather short, Francinaldo claims that he's always been attracted to tall women, and getting to date the tallest woman around has been a dream come true. Holding hands is a bit awkward since Elisani has to slouch, but they haven't let that get in the way of their romantic relationship. Jyoti MJ Hey, 
If you're a fan of American Horror Story, you'll immediately recognize this actress who played the role of Ma Petite in the fourth season of the show. And no, no CGI or camera tricks were needed in order for her to appear so very short. The 26-year-old Jyoti MJ is, in fact, the smallest living woman according to the Guinness Book of World Records, standing at just over two and a half feet tall and weighing only 11 pounds, so pretty much the size of a two-year-old child. Jyoti suffers from achondroplasia, a form of dwarfism which causes her short stature. The actress claims that there's more to her than just her unusual size and hopes to take on additional acting roles in the future. You might have seen her co-stars picking her up and coddling her in the show, but the truth is she doesn't like to be treated like that in real life and is annoyed when people touch her without permission. It's called a bubble, people. Respect the bubble. Do not encroach on the bubble. Aisha Mandela Wow, Molly! Look! 50-year-old Aisha Mandela from Florida has hair that measures an incredible 55 feet in length, making it longer than a bus. Oh, wow! Imagine your hair being as long as a bus. It comes as no surprise that the man Asha found to love is a professional hairstylist. Emmanuel Chedge contacted Asha online after being awestruck by photos of her famous dreadlocks. It was love at first sight for the pair, who were married eight months after they first met. Not only does Emmanuel support his wife, but he takes care of her 42 pounds of hair as well. Each day, he carefully grooms his wife's dreadlocks, and Asha trusts him to make sure they look just right. Washing and drying them takes two full days, but that hasn't deterred Emmanuel, who hopes to grow his own dreadlocks to a comparable length. When outside, Asha keeps her hair tucked into a handbag to prevent it from dragging on the ground. That makes total and perfect sense. Natalie Warrett 32 year old Natalie Warrett from Norfolk, UK, weighs over 350 pounds. She is happy with her weight, and so is her husband Liam. Natalie's bountiful body has also won her a legion of adoring fans online. She shares snapshots of her body on SSBBW websites. In case you're wondering, SSBBW is short for Super Sized Big Beautiful Women. On top of being the biggest fan of Natalie's body, her husband Liam also takes her photos, helping her post them online for her admirers. Bodybuilder Mother 40-year-old Lorna Bigham is a competitive bodybuilder, and that's not all. Lorna Bigham is a full-time firefighter, competitive bodybuilder, and mom to four kids. Wow, it's impressive. She's busy. She started bodybuilding in 2012 and entered the Scottish Championships a year later. Lorna's youngest daughter is only one year old. During her pregnancy, Lorna kept up her strict training regimen. Just 10 months after giving birth by C-section, she qualified for the British Finals. Now she juggles life as a mum, firefighter, and competitive athlete. This woman's like a real-life superhero, don't you think? I wish I was that organized. Weightlifting Mom Meet the mum who's pulling cars and hopes to become England's strongest woman. 32-year-old Becky Barrett may only be 5 feet tall, but that doesn't stop her from lifting weights of up to 300 pounds, twice her body weight. She can also pull and push cars that weigh one ton. Seriously, is there something she can't do? Becky now juggles her six-day-a-week fitness regimen with being a mom to six-year-old Kayla and holding down her job as a nursery worker. Whew, now that is a busy woman. World's Shortest Couple Meu, tô super nervoso, tô super nervoso. Paolo Gabriel da Silva Barros and Katiusia Hishano made it into the Guinness Book of World Records in November 2016. They've been recognized as the shortest married couple in the world. This tiny couple from Brazil both have forms of dwarfism. 34-year-old Paulo suffers from diastrophic dysplasia dwarfism. He drives a specially adapted car and works as a legal secretary. 31-year-old Katuccia, on the other hand, has achondroplasia dwarfism. She owns a beauty salon that has been specifically adapted for her height. The pair met online, but Paulo failed to impress at first and ended up being blocked by Katusha. Ouch! 
Thankfully, Katushia gave him another chance after a year later, and they, and they officially became a couple. Four years later, they started living together and soon got married. Monica Riley. It does feel strange uh, when I think like, oh my gosh, I'm a mom now. You know, she was growing inside me all that time. Monica Riley, an obese fetish model, made headlines when she declared she wanted to weigh a thousand pounds. Um, okay. Though she has 300 pounds to go, her boyfriend Sid is dedicated to making that happen. Good for you, buddy. Monica's goal is to be immobile, because she thinks she'll be treated like a queen and Sid will have to serve her every need. You really can't make this stuff up. Sid loves this idea, okay? And has become Monica's feeder and spends his day cooking and feeding her up to 8,000 calories worth of food a day. <sighs> Some people. Which one of these wives did you find the most unusual? Let me know in the comments below and I'll handpick and feature your comments in the next video. Look out for your comment. So this comment I handpicked was from Raul Earl. He says, Bro, I wish I had superpowers to heal all these little kids. Us too, Raul. Us too. I mean, how cool would that be? Yeah.